So, you know, normally I have a beer like about five, six o'clock after I'm done my work. And of course, you know, I'm on this journey with digital marketing. And so with that said, I um, got started last night and now I went to the dentist, had a tooth extraction. It was pure D H E double hockey sticks. I mean, in the middle of the night, I was throbbing, throbbing, but enough about that. You guys want to hear about that, but I was on my journey last night with Digital Mark, and I was going through a step-by-step -step blueprint. No hype, no upsells with this program. A full community is not another course. I have bought, I can't even say I'm embarrassed, but I've bought many, many, many courses. And I'm going to tell you what. I can remember, for those of you that might be in my age group, I can remember always wanting to start a business. And I've started a business. I've, this would be my second business. However, I wanted to not work as hard, but I still wanted to make a lot of money. So if you remember back in the day, they had these uh, in the paper, in the newspaper, and we still had newspapers back then, they had business opportunities. And the business opportunities, it had stuff in envelopes. I tried that, didn't work. Then fast forward, go online, there were many, many courses, drop shipping, um, uh, Amazon, uh, Spotify, um, Spotify. <laughs> uh, what's the name of this? Uh, let me see here. I can't think of the name of that store, but I think you know which one I'm trying to talk about. But I mean, all these different programs, uh, high ticket sales, went through a course on that. Um, you know, book writing, everything, and nothing seemed to be as detailed without someone trying to call me and upsell me or drill me on what my goals are. I figure out my own goals. I don't need nobody to ask me what my goals are. But anyhow, that's a whole nother story. But I was going through the blueprint last night and it was step by step by step by step. I mean, clear direction to the point that I was up to almost one o'clock in the morning. Now, my first appointment is at eight o'clock. <laughs> okay. I got to get out there and get it done now. Okay. Here's my coffee right here. Uh, let me see. Can you see that? And so I'm trying to get myself together here so that I can um, go out and do my so-called nine to five. And I say so-called because I've been a business owner for almost uh, 15 years now in the home improvement industry. And guess what? It was another, another trap because I would been, I have been held captive to my own company all of this time for almost 15 years driving back and forth to Northern Virginia. So trust me when I say this and I have a high level of integrity, it's that making a lot of money is not supposed to be hard. Jeff Bezos ain't working hard for his money. Zuckerberg is not working hard for his money. Uh, Bill Gates, I mean, I can go on and on. Warren Buffett, none of these guys are working hard for their money. And they, Warren Buffett, they said, show me your calendar. It wasn't nothing on it. So we have a stigma in our mind that making money is supposed to be hard. And it's not. It's easy. And if we change the story in our heads, we can change our total environment. Stay tuned as I'm continuing to go through this process and it's been nothing short of fun. And man, the community, the support, and the two hour workday, I am stoked. I keep you guys updated.